Hello, Gemini. Welcome back to New Hope Tarot, where we will be doing your relationship reading for April 22nd through April 30th. I have meditated upon the cards and I have pre shuffled. As always, though, I will shuffle live. During meditation, I a spirit showed me a like a door opening and that little bell dingling. They focused on the bell, which to me symbolized the fact for you to be aware <clears throat> of what's coming. That's that was really the only thing that I got from that. Mm. Okay. Codependency addictions are affecting your romantic life. Immediately, I'm seeing that you're not, I mean, just like the bell, you're not paying attention to your surroundings either. You're in a relationship and you're being gaslighted, so you're not paying attention to red flags. Or if you're not in a relationship, you are focused on other things other than your personal life is what I'm getting here. But if you are in a relationship, I'm just seeing that you are not, it's, it's almost like you're passive aggressive and, and it's not like you don't see it, but you don't give it much attention. You're just like, all right, whatever. It's either going to fix itself or it isn't. I'm just getting passive. Whether you're in a relationship or not, I'm getting a lot of passive energy. All right, for your cards, we have the Eight of Wands, the Four of Swords in reverse, the Seven of Pentacles in reverse, and the Three of Cups. Okay. All right, what I'm getting here is the fact that something's coming to you very, very quickly, um, but I feel like it, it might be coming in quickly, but I feel like you think it's slow is what I'm getting here because overall, Overall, I'm seeing that you're kind of tired of waiting and you're just like, I, I guess it just isn't coming. It is really what I'm seeing, but we have here the Eight of Wands and the Three of Cups. So I feel like you're going to soon celebrate something, but I, I feel like you're just like, you know what, it, it comes when it comes. It's just whatever you know, I'm just going to go live my life is the energy that I'm seeing here. It's very passive is what I was saying. Um, and that's for the people that are not in a relationship. For those who are in a relationship, I feel like maybe, you know, you entered this relationship a little too quickly, but I'm actually kind of seeing that you're bored and it, it was kind of anticlimactic and you kind of want your depend you, you, you kind of want your independence again is what I'm seeing here. Um, for the upcoming, what's coming up, we have the seven of cups, four of swords, the star and two of coins. Okay. Whenever something new, it comes in, which I feel is coming in rather quickly. I have a feeling like you you have no idea what to do. Um, like I feel like you have so many thoughts surrounding your your mind. You're like, whoa, this is happening, and I feel like you're trying to imagine like how that relationship is going to go. Um, 
but I feel like you're going to have a lot of peace with this particular relationship that's coming up because with the four swords and the start in combination, I just feel there's, there's peace, there's happiness there in a very calm way, not passive, just calm. Um, but I, I feel like there's some balancing to do with this relationship. And I feel it has to do with that, what I had mentioned with the codependency. And this is if um, you are not in a relationship, I, I feel like you have to work balance work-life relationship or work-life situations is what I'm seeing here. If you are already in a relationship, you might meet another person while still in a relationship. And that might give you that swift kick in the bum to move forward with something else. But you have a decision to make here. Your overall outcome is going to be abundance. Prepare yourself for the incoming abundance. Release any mental blocks you may have. In fairyland and human land, there is enough abundance for everybody or for everyone, I should say. And truly what I'm seeing here is the fact that you are going to have enough. This relationship will be enough. This upcoming relationship is going to be enough. And I feel like, again, like I said, it, I feel like peace and happiness. Uh, I feel like you're going to be very relaxed. And I know this seven of cups is not about dreams or, or, or anything, but I'm really seeing that this is something that you've been dreaming of for quite some time. And you're just like, oh my gosh, it's coming real. Are you joking? Um, but with that bell that I saw, pay attention to the signs. It is coming. That's what I have for you, my darling Geminis. I hope something in here did resonate. If it did, go ahead and click that um, subscribe button for me. I greatly appreciate it. If it didn't, go ahead and check out your sun, moon, rising signs. All right, my dear ones, until we meet again, have a great week.